May I help you? Oh, oh, my bad. Hold on one sec, one sec. Let me do something real quick. What's going on, y'all? It's Marcelo Tower, man. It's Echoey in a mug back here, but we are at the crib today, and this is a well-awaited. Is that is that the right word? Well-awaited. This is a well. This was a very highly requested video. My sneaker collection. Um, I haven't done one ever on my channel in, in the past nine years, so I guess today is you guys' lucky day. I told y'all, maybe we got something coming special for y'all. Today's that day. Now, before we go in, you know what I'm saying? Every, everybody gotta take their shoes off, and phones not allowed, no pictures. This is this is a one-time territorial look. You guys, you guys ready for this? Are they, are they ready? Hold on one second, man. Should we go one shoe at a time, or should we, what should we do? Let's get straight to it. <clears throat> yes, sir. I like the angles. Don't get too much of the shoes. Now, I, I, I believe I have the best Vans shoe collection on the YouTube scene. So let's go ahead and go with some of my favorites. All right, so I call these the Purple Thunders. You feel me? As you can see right here, we got the little charge bolt symbol right here with the polka dot laces. One of one, no one in the world got these. Uh, that's, that's a guarantee. You know what I'm saying? We, we call these the PB and J's right here. My boy, Keenan, customized these himself. Put a little Louis Vuitton, a little stencil on it right there like that. Uh, those are pretty dope, man. So these are my first pair of like exclusive vans that I cop. Um, I was able to put my 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 nickname on the back. This is the Selly Bow Specials right here, if you can see that. Yeah, these are pretty crazy right here, I man. These are like my first pair of like custom edition type vans. And after that, I kind of fell in love. We got the suede. It's real lovely, man. It's real lovely. Now, now these right here, we call these the roses, the red, violets, and blue. You feel me? <laughs> you ain't got this shoe. Got the roses on the bottom with the red leather right here. Um, did it with the check. It's pretty elite. Uh, you know, I, I I take care of all my shoes. I've had these for about over almost a year now. I want to say. Um, yes. Yeah, so, oh, yeah. Oh, these are one of my favorites, though. So uh, you, you can't tell, but these are beige and blue checker, navy blue checker with yellow suede on the, um, I forgot what the part's called, damn it. What is it called? Whatever it's called, yellow suede with the yellow van check right there. But look, there's a very special detail. This part's also beige, so it kind of blends in with the shoe. It's, you know what I'm saying, it's just next level stuff that not a lot of us are there. Oh, gotta bring these out. These are the creator specials. I dropped a little merch line with these. A little logo on the side here. I barely wore these like that because like these are kind of special to me. These are my first kind of merchandise drop, so I, I had these made with that. So um, I try to keep these in good condition. Enough with those. Let's go to some of my special things, man. The Toy Stories, Toy Story Jones, the Woodies, which oh look at that, the Andy on the bottom. Pretty self-explanatory, man. If you watch Toy Story, you know exactly who Woody is and you know what these are about. Those were my favorite shoes. I wear those a lot. Oh, we gotta show them these. Now I promise you, no one, nobody in the YouTube game got these. Guaranteed right now. We call these the Rugrats. That's Angelica. The dinosaur, I don't know the dinosaur's name if they have one. Damn, I don't even know the black girl's name, keep it 100. Chucky right here, I know Chucky, that was my boy. Yeah, shout out my boy Elijah, uh, Island. Island Crown Customs, man. Hit them up if you need some. These are called the, I call these a purple, I mean the uh, the teal flamers. The color scheme is crazy, man. When I made these, I wasn't too fond of these, man. We got the checkerboard tongue here, the flame on the side. Uh, everything I like to do, man, it's kind of loud, you know what I'm saying? So when it comes to shoes and sneakers, I wouldn't call myself a sneaker head. I really call myself a person who just gets what they like, you know what I mean? So. I like all my, I wear all my shoes. I've worn every single pair of my shoes except for one, and I'll show you which one I haven't worn today because I really don't like the shoe. So I don't know why I got that one. Then we got these right here. We got the Storms, Revenge Storms, man. These aren't really uh, Vans, but they got the Van type of look. So uh, I count them as Vans in a way. So yeah. These are probably my most like meaningful Vans. So my graduation uh, from college, I was gifted a pair of blank white vans that people were able to ride on. Whose idea was this? Let's see, yours is Trinice's. Trinice's, well yeah, my sister, she got these shoes for everybody to sign at the graduation, so these actually mean a lot, man. I read these messages pretty often sometimes, just to remind myself like where I came from. Oh, there's Dominique right there. I love you, babe, God is good, Dominique. These will never be worn, I can never wear these. So, they will yellow, like, as you see, I don't know if you can see it through the camera, but the yellowing. With age right now, I haven't even. These have never been on my feet. It's a sentimental piece of progress and growth. Now we're done with the vans. Like I said, I got the coldest vans, coldest van game on YouTube, man. Um, I didn't even show you. Come on, bro. Come on now. Just simple. 
These little simple little steppers, man, the little Marvel joints. All right, let's see if y'all can name each one of these characters. All right, I know I can. So, Spider-Man, Hulk, Thor, Black Panther, Captain America, oh, Iron Man, and uh, uh, who is that girl? Dang it, don't know her name. All right, man, so I've had these since 2011 in high school. These are like my favorite Jordans in high school. All my high school bros know about these, man. I wore these out, the cool grays. These are the 2011 edition, so they're pretty old, pretty beat up. In high school, I wore 10 and 10 and a half. Now I wear a size nine. It just doesn't make sense. That's why these don't get worn a lot. Can't really fit them. Um, yeah, <laughs> kind of weird, but yeah. Now we got the, the DMPs. Shout out Chance Sports for these ones. Uh, I've only wore these once. I wore these actually in the video. I got the keys to this house. House tour coming soon. If I haven't dropped it already. I don't know if I dropped it yet. I'll show you my favorite four. Which one is it? So these are like my favorite fours when I was a kid. Never got my hands on them, but I think my sister did. So when these came back out, I had to make sure I copped these. Shout out to Champ Sports again for sending me these, man. These are like one of my favorite fours. I just love gray. Gray is one of my favorite colors you see on the floor. We got gray floors, gray paint. Well, this isn't gray, but gray paint around the house. Um, so it's only right that, you know, I got these uh, cool gray fours right here. These right here, okay. Sto story about these. These are my favorite pair of J's, uh, the number 12s. Um, this colorway, when I was also a kid. Never got a chance to get these. My friends were supposed to sell me a pair of them, never sold them to me. So I said, oh, when these come back out, I gotta cop them. Haven't worn these as much. As you see, they're yellowing around the rim right there because they just haven't been worn a lot. But the French Boot 12s, yeah, it's a classic shoe, man. You can't go wrong with the color. Um, the color is crazy. The leather on the old shoe is way better. The leather on all these shoes back in the day are way better. So, Jordan, you could do a better job on the quality part. But hey, I'm just a peasant in your world. Yeah. So now let's move to the ones. For those of you who know me, I'm a big Jordan 1 fan. Oh my gosh, I love Jordan 1s, which is why I'm saving those for last. <laughs> Let me show you these first, man. I'm a, I'm a big believer in Christ, and you know, I'm a Christian. The Lord's Child Converse um, Custom Edition. We got the baby blue, the pink tongue with the red. The inside on both shoes, just like that. The yellow trim, I like these a lot. All right, these are my backyard legend joints. I wore these in, uh, I think it was Zay Senior Night. Um, when we vlogged me, Cape Mon, and Trio, I wore these on my feet. I wear these a lot. These are like my go-to uh, Converse and slip-on shoes. They're really, they're not really comfortable, but they're just stylish. You know what I mean? Styling, profiling, can't go wrong with that. And, and I, I know you guys are wondering. There's a lot of hoodies in here. Yes, I have a lot of hoodies. Uh, I've never seen anybody really do a hoodie collection, but I think my hoodie collection is kind of top tier, uh, if you ask me. All right, so before we get to the J's and the exclusives, um, I'll leave my top five for last. I'll do a top five for you guys at the end. Let's go to my hoop shoes a little bit. All right, so I'm gonna give you a quick story about each shoe. Black History Month, Kyrie threes. I believe, if I'm not mistaken, no, these aren't them. I wore these in college a few games. I think I had, did I have 20 in these? Damn, I don't remember about that shoe, don't know. These shoes right here, my favorite Kyrie. Do you see I wear these the most? They're freaking brown and uh, Dana turning orange right here. The Kyrie four Black History Month, it means a lot. These are my Black History Month Kyrie threes. I try to get a pair of Kyrie uh, Black History Months every year they come out. Uh, because you know, I gotta represent Black History Man. You know what I'm saying? Fist up. The concepts, oh, this, oh. These day near top five just because of the story behind these. So I had these on my feet when I first met Kyrie Irving in person. The story I told you guys about a while ago last year when I first met him, he called me by my first name. These are on my feet. He had just dropped these like the weekend before. So it was kind of a sentimental moment to wear these. My career took off doing a Kyrie Irving video. So yeah. Then we got the LeBron Lowe's. Um, not really a special story about those. Then we got the tacos. These are the MVP joints. I got MVP the Balls Life game when I wore these. Yeah, dropped 30 in these, man. You know, these are the 30 balls right here. You, you, you do what I'm saying? Kobe's, I wore these in a lot of videos. Twisted my ankle in these a lot off camera that I didn't get to show you guys. Twisted my ankle and my ankle started bleeding in these. I don't know why. No story behind these. These, these are in my trunk of my car. I never really wore these that much. They kind of look kind of new. Now let's move on to my junior college kicks I had a lot of 30 balls in these a lot of 30 point games in these kicks right here the Kyrie Irving twos uh, these are one of his first two that he dropped down to my special babies I dropped my career high 45 points 10 rebounds in these very shoes right here so I can never get rid of these which is why I got two pair 
know what I'm saying? One to rock and one to rock. Uh, I rock both of them, so, you know. Uh, the Pumas got these in uh, All-Star Weekend. These right here, Puma just sent me these, and I'm really gonna show you those right now. The Rockets got these in All-Star Weekend. Shout out EA Sports. Yeah, I wear these a lot. These are really comfortable, comfortable shoe. I got them for free. You can't beat that. <laughs> if it's free, it's me. You feel me? Uh, got these from Jordan um, Jordan Bale's uh, charity celebrity game for uh, MS, the Race to Race MS. Um, dope event, man, dope event. These were my first pair of Paul George's, uh, if I can get these for you guys. <laughs> You're on your tippy toes. Oh, you just trying to roast my, oh yeah, I got the, I got the Ugg moccasins on right now, you know, say something like you feel me. We got the first pair of PG's I had, so, can't get rid of these, man. Kobe's got these at the outlet for 80 bucks. And now these are going online for like dang near 200, $300. It's crazy. Like after everything that happened with Kobe, everybody started selling his shoes for double the price, which I don't respect that at all. Like that's, that makes no sense to me. Uh, Kobe AD, shout out my people at Nike. My boy Avery hooked me up with these at Nike. Um, I only wore these a couple times. I don't wanna wear these outside and, and mess them up a little bit, but it's kind of like a unique way. Like you tie it through here, you release it. Like you pull this tab to tighten. It's kind of dope. It's kind of a dope way to tie the shoe. Shout out EA Sports for these, man. I uh, got these on 824. Is that Kobe's birthday? I don't know. I don't know. Did you just say it's 824 Kobe's birthday? That's his, that's his jersey number. It's 8 and 24. Uh, right? The glow in the dark, Jones. I'm going to show y'all something. Watch this. Just watch this. Watch the shoe. Can y'all see the shoe? Can y'all see the shoe? Go, uh, go in the dark, Kobe 11s. My boy Tyler gave me those, man, gifted. Shout out my boy Ty. KD, I think these are the 10 lows, I'm gonna say, the Oreos. These are the, these are the shoes I had 20 with in uh, my university career at Holy Names University. Dislocated my shoulder in these. I reached in on the ball. The big man brought the ball up. Shoulder went out of socket. I missed six games. Um, we were making a playoff run as well. That was our third game in a row we won. And I got hurt that game, we lost, so. The Safari, LeBron, uh, 16 lows, I wanna say. Shout out people at Nike for sending me those. Shout out Under Armour for the Sour Patch Kids, Steph Curry Jones, yeah! In the lab. They got their own shoe, bro. That's so inspiring. My boy Devin, the lab man, real cool dude. I used to watch him all the time on TV with 10,000 hours when he was working out Trevor Dunbar and his brother LaMelo. I said LaMelo, I think it's just Melo Dunbar, not LaMelo. Uh, but yeah, he had his own shoe, man. So I had a cop, you know, I bought these full price. You know, I don't I don't like discounts when, you know, I support people like, you know, I really support them. So I show love that way. Then we got the AI Answers. Uh, had these in two, since 2011, so about nine years. Pretty busted. Got the D-Wades, special no sleep, D-Wade, lean knee. I think these are the threes, I wanna say. So these are 3M all the way around. On the tongue right there, you see it, team no sleep. Um, and that's the base of the shoe right there. You know, kinda, kinda unique shoe, man. I wore those in my D'Angelo Russell, recent video, D'Angelo Russell video. And these right here, I call these the Cliffs, man. RIP Cliff, my boy passed away. Uh, I think it's been about three years now. So yeah, I had to write these on these shoes, man. I, could, I can't ever get this shoe away no matter what. I don't really wear it that much no more, but I wore these in college too as well with his name on it. You guys can see it. The Giannis's custom joints right here. On the inside it says backyard. On the back says 95, the year I was born, 1995. So, uh, you know, like I guess I like all my shoes to have some type of meaning behind it when I customize them and create them. We got Kyrie Fives. I forgot what uh, those are called, but these are the Kyrie 5 LA's, only released in LA with the graphic behind them. Like I said, Kyrie's one of my favorite, you know, hoopers, so I love hooping in his shoes. Oh, these are the concepts, his Kyrie 5 concepts, one of the concepts he came out with. You see it on the tongue right there. Yeah, so, you know, enough with the hoop shoes, man. Let's, let's dive into the swag, man. Hope you guys enjoyed part one, man. Part two is on the way very soon. Turn on post notifications because you do not want to miss it. I will not be announcing when I'm dropping it. It'll just be dropping out of nowhere like some bad news. And uh, in part two, I will be showing you guys my top 10 and all my exclusive heat. So when you see the thumbnail for part two, just know none of the shoes in the thumbnail are in my top 10. So I got some shit for y'all, man. I'll see y'all in part two, you dig? I love y'all, appreciate it. Let's get it. Hey, yeah! Hey, you guys. Uh. I cannot forget to show you these. Y'all, my bad, I forgot to show y'all the, the exclusive pink suede Jones with the zebra tongue. Oh my gosh, come on, so you gotta do better than that, bro. Oh, hello. How did I forget to show you guys these? The Proud Family exclusives. Nobody in the world got these shits, bro. You seen it here live and direct. I got the Cornish Van game on YouTube. Stop playing with me. Hands up, cash out the Grove Sisters. You know what I'm saying? We got Sticky, Dijonay, 
Penny Proud, Oscar Proud, the twins. Um, we got Sugar Mama. Who we got? Uh, what? I forgot. Uh, Uncle Uncle Bobby, and we got uh Trudy. This is my favorite show growing up. How can I forget to show you guys these? Thank you guys for watching. Oh, wait, 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 you guys. One more, one more. The Harry Potter specials. The black suede sun with the red checkered liner right here with the checkered liner with the Harry Potter graphics. Bro, my, my, come on, bro. Stop playing with me. Okay. All right. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Love you guys. Yeah.